What's up everyone, here is Akta, welcome back on my YouTube channel. In this video I'm gonna show you what team did I use in order to beat the special stage number 4 of this Elemental City Desert. So this is what I used here, so I build my Anna but I now, for now, she has no skill up, so uh, she is still doing a good job, a great job, I would say. She is exclusive one, that means she is gonna give an attack buff 40% to my team, which is pretty huge with need roll. He is only exclusive one, in the future I'm planning to put two eyes, two eyes on him in order to push the faction abyss uh, with the same team here. Uh, so, um, I have exclusive one on Anna because on the last month uh, she was given for free on the hero quest and I summoned one so I have two copies of her uh, I was trying to use that before but in fact I, I could reach the boss wave but inflict only a 40% of his max HP before the turn limitation so I needed more damage this is why I was using I, I used a, um, not a gata Una. Uh, space without exclusive, Visley here, in order to lower the attack of enemies by 40%, this is mandatory if you want to stay alive, even if you have the consolidation, you don't have the consolidation on every turn, so trust me, the attack down on enemies is a must have. And finally, I have uh, Elik to protect my heroes. Uh, I won't lie, but the exclusive 3 helped me a lot, and you are gonna see that. Exclusive 3, he gives a shield by 30% of his max HP, so yeah, it's pretty huge. So first of all, let's increase my turn meter, lower the attack of enemies, and apply the shield and the consolidation to my heroes. Let's inflict some bleeds on them, and let and look at the damage of Anna. Uh, first of all, I'm gonna do that to increase my attack by 40%. You need the first exclusive to get the attack buff on your heroes. Uh, let's lower the speed of the Drake. Perfect. Increase my crit rate, it doesn't really matter in fact, because he has the highest amount of attack in my team, but he can't land a crit. Um, the bleed damage can't be, it can't be increased by crit rate. So let's lower the turn meta to the right and look at the damage coming from Need Road, and then we are gonna compare with Anna without any skill ups. If you have a look there, uh, 54k attack with the attack buff here, he has some crit rate buffs, and he has 122% mastery, a lot of effect hit, and that's all on him. He has all the skill uh, here, all skill ups. Anna has zero skill ups, 142% mastery, 53k attack. Pretty nice. So let's have a look to the damage. Need rolled, look at the Drake. Pretty nice though. The HP were here, where, where I have the cursor. So now let's have a look to Anna. So I'm gonna put the cursor here on the health bar and let's have a look. No skill ups. Pretty nice though, without any skill up. So it's working pretty well on the waves and now I'm gonna accelerate the run and just try to uh, focus enemies one by one. Because we have to kill them all together. Uh, is there a burn? Yeah, there is a burn. I'm gonna try to detonate it. Perfect, it worked. So, more damage to everyone. Uh, let's inflict an extra bleed to uh, this one so he's gonna share more bleed damage with others. Try to stun, okay, let's say heal, um, increase my attack, apply some burns, ooh, was close to die uh, with my Anna. Uh, I'm gonna try to do that, bleed here, I hope this one is gonna die, otherwise my Anna, okay, she's protected by my Elik for now, but uh, it won't last a long time. Uh, let's try to reduce the turn meta. Shield, consolidation, detonate the burn, it didn't work. Okay, so for now I am still alive. 
Perfect, so I'm gonna keep my cooldowns for the next wave, let's, yeah, kill them. Okay, second wave, I don't have my heal with, with a space, but with this speed buff, normally she should be able to play before them. Uh, let's try to lower the speed of, the, of this enemy, lower their attack, apply some buffs, deal some damage. Nope, I wasn't able to play before them. So maybe my heroes are gonna die. N no, I'm still alive, I can heal, okay. Perfect. Let's try to stun him. Didn't work. Lower the turn meta of the Scorpio, really important, they deal a lot of damage. Uh, I'm gonna keep this one until I have the attack buff, maybe? No, I have no skill up, so I have to be patient. So let's use that. Consolidation and shield. Speed reduction, attack buff, okay, uh, some bleeds to the, on the drake, lower the turn meta, I'm taking a lot of damage on my space, I hope she is not gonna die, lower the attack, perfect, let's see heal, nice, uh, more bleeds on this one, Buffs, detonation, buffs, turn meta reduction on this one, try to stun, let's use this one, I want to kill them now. They are almost all dead, so now it's pretty safe. But I have to kill them all at once, otherwise the others are gonna revive themselves and I want to avoid that. Let's use that. Perfect, boss wave. So now, as always, let's uh, speed down the boss, lower the attack. We want to kill... Uh, I'm gonna target the boss here, because I have only AoE attack, so normally the hands uh, should die together. Uh, let's use... Let's put it in auto. Normally it should do the job. Because I have an attack down on the boss, I have a speed down on the boss, I have a, a, a huge amount of buffs on my heroes and a huge amount of damage, so normally I should be pretty safe here. Now it's taking a lot of time because of the animations. So when you have the end here, you are forced to focus, to focus the boss or this hand. And if you kill one hand but not the other, if the boss takes a turn, he's gonna uh, slap all your heroes and deal a huge amount of damage. So be careful about that. You want to kill the two hands together at once. But it seems like one hand is gonna die before the other. So I hope that I'm gonna survive. We are gonna see. We are gonna see. I'm gonna try to focus this hand though. Otherwise it's, take, it's taking a lot of turns and I want to avoid that. Perfect. Nice, only the boss remaining. So now he's broken, all my attacks are gonna go on the boss, he's gonna take a huge amount of bleed damage, and it's gonna be easier. Look at the damage. On a single target, Need Rolled is a great unit. Even if you don't have the exclusive 2 and the exclusive 3, as you can see. But he is way better with exclusive 2 at least. And exclusive 3, more attacks, so more damage on the ultimate. And it's, almost, it's already done. Pretty nice though. 20 million damage on Anna without any skill up on her. This is amazing, isn't it? I'm gonna try to uh, skill up in the future and see her potential, so I'm gonna have my team for the Faction Abyss. I hope you enjoyed the video, if it's the case, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Have a nice day, see you soon, bye bye! Okay.